Welcome back to Mackenzie's Animation Corner. Today I'm going to be watching another episode of Harley Quinn. And today's episode is called Finding Mr. Right. And I am very excited to get back into this show. I'm wearing a Disney shirt today. Neither of the shows I'm going to be filming today are Disney, but I have a lot of Disney shirts and I don't have any shirts that say Warner Bros. Animation or DreamWorks. So it's just what I had. I'm excited to be getting into another episode of Harley Quinn. I'm really liking this show so far, and yeah, let's just jump right into it. Does it always start like this? Oh, that's why. Looks like the music sounds so weird. It sounds like a vacuum cleaner. That big vacuum. Dude, that was a Noguchi coffee table. News probably did us first. Or try Channel 7. And Batman foils Joker. Uh, just let me look. We're the most compelling Ooh, story, so they're probably saving her. us for last. And now our last and most compelling story. Enter us. Turn up the volume. It's about damn time. A cardboard box of baby ferrets has finally been returned to their rightful owners. Oh, boy. <laughs> You have been here two weeks oh, and you have destroyed nine TVs. Sorry. Of course, Joker has Batman. And suddenly a simple crime becomes a thrilling narrative between oh. two titans. Exactly. He's an arch nemesis. A nemesis. Lex Luthor has Superman. Sinestro has Green Lantern. Psycho has his own inability to refrain from using the C word. My nemesis is Wonder Woman. That cop. Okay, I see what you're saying. That's it then. <laughs> I need a nemesis. Great advice, I. No, that's 100% not. <laughs> I feel like Ivy, even though she loves Harley, is starting to get a little tired of having somebody else in her space. She's used to going this alone. And I, I get that. <laughs> You're messing up my apartment! Your apartment? It's my apartment! And if your dirty psychic freak friends keep <laughs> messing it up, I'm kicking you out! You know the rules! No pets, no noise! No commies, no that right! I don't know if he was gonna get racist there, but it felt like that's where oh, it was really? at. My job! <laughs> Oh, 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 this is a classic misunderstanding. Bat down, bat down. <laughs> this is King Shark. How this giant, terrifying half man, half shark is a computer whiz? I don't like to nice. brag, but he took me from eight social media followers to He's eight. He's got kind eyes. Why did I say that? We put the profile up and we're not getting any bites. Is that a shark joke? If so, it's very funny. <laughs> Let's this is my new favorite character. Hmm. We get Batman. Batman, you have fought him countless times, and every time you end up at Arkham. I know another way, and by the end of it, Bats will be our nemesis. I don't know. Unlikely. Yes, 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 yes. I think this is a bad plan. She needs to pick somebody else. Car's voice activated, so I took some recordings of Bat's voice and spliced them together. Open Batmobile. Allow Harley to drive. He also said, I definitely make love to Bats. Ah! Heavens to Murgatroy, he admits it. <laughs> A grappler. The Batters have arrived. Success. <laughs> Stop talking. I gotta make an evil first impression. Shit, I should have thought of an opening line. A uh, good after doom? Pleasure to beat ya. Not so fast, <laughs> losers. Oh, come on. And you're a clown and an old one at that. What are you, 30? <laughs> Little shit. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Put me down. Tell Batman we're coming for him. Well, Tawny, then Harley said, I'm coming for you. Of course, then we had a huge battle. Mm -hmm. Tons of punching. Mm -hmm. Some lasers, a mm -hmm. lot of lasers. Boy, stop it. When I beat her butt, that's oh, when she no. asked it would be her nemesis. Your first no. nemesis. No, 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 no,
gotta tell you, I think he's adorable. <laughs> you know what? This one's on me. I should have known that this was gonna put you in a smashy mood. Robin's lying. Why would I fight a kid? I wish she'd smash the TV this hair on their chest. Mm. Bringing this back I don't to. think so. You just got a Google alert that? for an article from the Lois Lane, and the headline is Never mind. Let me see that. Harley Quinn fights child sets evil women's movement back decades. <gasps> ah! Well, the headline is clickbait, but I bet the article itself is more positive. Sorry, everyone. I know, I don't know what happened to it either, Katie. Where did it go on here? Now it's gone. Oh, there it is. What you're looking for, right? This bit. Okay, you ready? Hold on, get it out the door. Oh, there you go. Okay, back to filming. You bring it back already? Oh my goodness, you're fast. Do any of y'all have cats that can play fetch? Because mine is talented. Okay. Uh, back to this. Or we kidnap her and make her retract the article. You can't fuck with Lois Lane, people. What if Superman comes? Great. Then I'll have the most powerful nemesis in the world. Oh, brother. I don't retract articles, and I'm definitely not writing a puff piece about... What was your headline? It's Harley Quinn, the number one supervillain in the mini multiverses, still hasn't committed to a nemesis, much less Robin the Boy Wonder, or any nemesis that's boy or bird based. That's a long you can punch headline. Up if you want, you're the writer. <laughs> is she mad about the paywall too? Seven ninety nine is an ambitious price point, and it doesn't include the crossword, which is ridiculous. You gonna fight me or what? <laughs> Everybody duck. You were ill advised to think you could. Oh no, Harley Quinn. <laughs> That's humiliating to Oh my god, I mean you're pregnant? Oh, this is gonna be so bad for your career, but so good for your Instagram. What? No, all this shit is for you. Aw, no baby. Nope, no baby. But there is a card and it was addressed to you, so I didn't open it because I'm not a rude person. Congrats on Robin the Cradle. <laughs> From all your never going to be your friends at the Legion of Doom. <laughs> oh, I'm not that kind of shark. I'm more of a tech savvy kind. It's fine. I can play the role of shark if he won't. Raw! Tis I, the violent type of shark! Straight from the beaches of Amity, fear my rows of teeth by unpredictable nature! Yeah, that's offensive in a number of ways. I'll just be the shark. <laughs> You to be my nemesis. Those rubes will believe anything I say. <laughs> Busted! You hear that, Tawny? He admitted he lied. Tawny, you set me up, Quinn. Mm, mm, mm. My oh my, how the sweet potato pie has crumbled. She probably figured out that. can see, I could have killed him any time I wanted, but I didn't, because he's a kid and kids are gross. Also, he is not my nemesis. Oh no, not the blood. Killed my ward. You're going to Arkham Cut? for good, <laughs> Quinn. All right. Bring it on, bats. <laughs> bats. Batman. Is he? This is no fun. Uh, uh, boss. Uh, 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 watch Steve. Spit it the fuck out. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> she 
may not be ready for Batman yet. <laughs> I always do. My entire existence seems to be spent cleaning up your fucking messes. Is that gonna be bleeped? Please welcome another surprise guest, supervillain Poison Ivy! Nope. Not a guest. Also, I actually identify as an eco-terrorist, so... Seems like you're having some animosity towards Harley for not respecting your boundaries. Am I right, audience? <laughs> you saw this. Tell us how you feel. No, no, not gonna do that. Okay. But since I'm here, if I could just... You don't have to rinse out your cans and bottles before putting them in the recycling bin, okay? That's it's a myth and it wastes water. Is that true? I always do that. <laughs> Harley, what the fuck do you think you're doing? She is getting a lot of mystery guests on this show. After all this, I still don't have a nemesis. You know, you can't force it. I mean, there's someone out there just for you. <sighs> Do the crimes that make you happy and the rest will come. JKH, right? Just keep high steps. JK's already a thing. You add an H to it, and I don't know what that is. It's muddled. Yeah, I'm not here to workshop this. Thanks for always giving me great advice, Ivy, even if I don't always use it. You actually never use it. But I love never using your advice more than anyone else's advice I never use. Yes, I'm in the crew. It's just nice to be on a schedule. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you saw what he can do when he flips out. I mean, how am I going to say no to that? You're out of here. This is a formal eviction notice. You're evicting me? On what grounds? Your lease says no pets. Him! Well, that's racist. Or at the very least, xenophobic. Xena who? The bikini broad with the sword as big as she is? I love her. But the shark's been coming in here all week. Please, Ty. I love this apartment more than anything. I, I, I'll kick them out. I'll kick all of them out. Too late. You're evicted, honey. Hey, oh, at no. least you don't have to keep cleaning up after us anymore, right? Because, you know, let's be honest, it was really only going to I'm livid because everyone in Teen Titans is getting a nemesis except me. I'm gonna say something embarrassing here. I didn't have a nemesis until my late 20s. Don't patronize me, father. It's unbecoming. Batman is not Robin's dad, right? All right, that was another super fun episode. I really liked it. I liked the introduction of a new character, um, King Shark. Uh, he seems really cool, and I like that they have added another member to the team. I kind of hope that they're gonna add a few more people to the team because right now her team is kind of small. I'm wondering where it's going to go with what they introduce at the end here that Ivy's getting evicted. If maybe we'll get an episode where she is hunting for a new house or something, that would be fun. Um, and then I liked, of course, Ivy coming to Harley's rescue when she got in trouble with Batman and everything. Uh, I like their dynamic still a lot. I liked that the audience also all kind of picked up like, ooh, what's going on there between Harley and Ivy? Um, so that was a lot of fun. I am realizing that some of my lack of knowledge about DC is maybe becoming a little bit of, oh, thank you, you brought me this again, wow. Oh, I'm realizing I think some of my lack of knowledge about the DC universe uh, is becoming a little detrimental. I also have a confession to make. I have never watched Teen Titans, either of them, uh, Teen Titans or Teen Titans Go!, I don't think I've seen a single episode of either of those shows, so I know as a cartoon lover, I feel like I'm fake, but uh, I didn't watch cartoons a lot when I was younger, and then when I got older, I heard Teen Titans Go was bad, and so I decided not to watch that, and then never felt like going back to watch Teen Titans, so that's how that happened. I feel like there was probably a lot of jokes in there about Robin like being from Teen Titans and everything, but... I just didn't really get that. I looked it up and it was not the same voice actor that voices Zack him in Teen Titans, so I knew that at least. I think that's about it. Um, still really liking this show. Like where it's going. Um, and I'm really liking the characters and everything. So, yeah. I'm excited for the rest of the season. If you enjoyed this video of me reacting to Harley Quinn, feel free to like this video and then subscribe to my channel for more. I post videos 
where I react to Harley Quinn every Tuesday, and then I post videos where I react to the Dragon Prince on Fridays. And uh, feel free to leave a comment down below, especially if you have a fun tip bit about Teen Titans or DC or anything that I like very obviously missed uh, because I don't have any knowledge about that. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Such a good kitty. You know that? And then you have to be in all my videos. Okay, ready?